This Underwater Minute is brought to you by Aquaview, the original underwater camera. We just got done with a super cool experience with Doug Schultz, area fisheries supervisor in Walker, doing musky spawn take. It's a really cool process, so walk us through it, Doug. We've been at this for about a week now, and, and what we do is we go into Miller's Bay, uh, set trap nets. Uh, fish will come in during the night looking for warm water, run into those trap nets, and then uh, we check them the next day and pull the fish out. Uh, and we separate the males and the females, uh, find the females that are ready to go, and uh, take eggs from her, and, and we'll try to pair her to at least two different males. You know, we mix the milk and the eggs together, uh, fertilize, uh, actually stir them with a turkey feather, believe it or not, uh, because it's soft and those eggs are real sensitive to being damaged. And then they have to sit in water harden for a couple hours until we can actually transport them safely to the hatchery. Uh, the eggs coming from here off of Leech today are destined for our hatchery in Park Rapids. And uh, they're going to sit there for another two, three weeks until they hatch out. And uh, at that time we'll stock them into our, our rearing ponds. And uh, in the fall we'll harvest those rearing ponds. And those fish then get distributed to uh, a lot of our broodstock lakes sure. around the state, which we use for our annual uh, musky egg take needs. So we're only in leech once every, every uh, four years right now. And the purpose of that is just to get fresh genetics to put in those broodstock lakes that we actually use on an annual basis. So sure. by, by coming here to the source every four years and, and getting a fresh uh, slug of genetics in the system, we keep those uh, just as healthy as, as we are this one. Well, I can tell you from first-hand experience that the program is working because there's awesome opportunities for muskies across the state of Minnesota. They're spectacular fish. If you fished them here in my home state of Minnesota, you know what I'm talking about. If you haven't, you need to come enjoy this awesome resource that these guys are doing an awesome job of making accessible for a lot of people.